Hello guys, welcome to another episode of the Tour Guide. Today I'm going to show you the number one necessity, and you're not going to be able to get around this one unless you have, you know, a rubber mat or a rubber floor or something like that, and even then I would recommend one of these. This is an anti-static mat. Basically, in, you, you also want to wear gloves for every device repair, rubber gloves. Basically, you have static in your body. It goes through. You sometimes notice it and stuff, you know, if you touch someone, they get shocked or something like that. Now, that's always there. So if you mess with the teeny tiny um, things, uh, the, these teeny tiny, you know, electronics in the back of uh, your phone or whatever, it will mess with it and you can break your device simply with the static goes through your hands or through your body and that that's a big problem because if you break it you're gonna have to buy that man a new logic board if it fries or whatever now that's why you want to use one of these and let me show you this that's what one of them looks like you see they're um they're, they're pretty big okay and the one from my fix it includes uh this right here which is some bag which is what you would uh one second, put you know all this stuff in like the uh, like the anti-static uh, wrist strap which I'm gonna be showing you or which I already did show you in another video but I'm gonna be showing you again this right here is our anti-static wrist, wrist strap now we want to put this on okay put this on like that then you got um you got this right here that you wanna oh, sorry see this click it on and then this you want to you know put to your ground wire or whatever but you basically just kind of clip it on this mat like like so and then you can work like that you know you, you want to have it connected to some sort of ground wiring on um, if you have your own shop or something like that you have a ground wire there, you should have a ground wire pretty close if you're doing it in your garage or whatever, you know, that you should be able to find one pretty simple. Um, anything will work, I mean, this, the setup like that should work, I haven't had any problems with it, worked fine for me. You do want to have some sort of rubber gloves I would recommend, that really does help. Um, now, rubber gloves will make you a little bit more, you know, immobile but and it'll make it a little harder but not too much don't be a crybaby because it's gonna cost you money if you're a crybaby and no one likes crybabies okay thanks for watching this episode tool guide out